Hi, Sophie Juliano here with my essential oil series, and I'm sitting here with Shrankla Holacek of Uma Oils, who is an Ayurvedic expert, and she is the girl that I turn to for all my really sound, trusted knowledge about essential oils. Hello, Shrankla. <laughs> Hi, Sophie. So look, here's a question that I have for you. This is the, the, the question that so many of my readers and followers ask me all the time. How can we tell if an essential oil is pure, basically, if it's the real thing? Thing. Sophie, that's a million dollar question, probably because it can cost you up to a million dollars to really figure that out in a lab, which is the truly empirical way to do it. Um, that being said, there are a lot of resources we can use, such as research. One about where the producer is growing their oils. That's often a dead giveaway because all the plants in the world don't grow everywhere in the world. So if you are hearing that everything is getting produced in the United States, that's a red flag because you know that's geographically and not environmentally possible. not possible. Oh, of course. Um, the second thing you want to look at their distillation mechanisms and how embedded their company is in infrastructure because these are very involved and expensive processes. Often you can find literature on the company about these things. So those are elements of research I would implore you to put into. Okay. And, and finally, for somebody, if we're just in a store and we want to know if something, we pick up a little oil, is it pure or not? Is it to do, I've always thought that the potency of the smell is really important. Is that a bit of a, 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 a good uh, clue? It is actually. Essential oils um, are very interconnected to sensory perception. So more than any other time in your life, trust your instinct here. Okay. Two things. One is the more volatile an essential oil is, the higher its potency. So if you're getting a lot of aromas, that's a good sign. Number two is dwell on how the essential oil makes you feel. Spend 30 seconds absorbing that in and figuring that out. And that will be extremely telling on how therapeutic that oil That's can be for you. That's a brilliant answer. Because if I smell an amazing oil, I'm just, oh my gosh, that is amazing. Thank you so much, Shrankla. And we'll be back. Check out all the other videos in this series about essential oils.